name is Heidi Bock, I am from BMW and I show you now the digital services in the new 3 Series. What do we have here? We have the beautiful new BMW operating system 7.0 in the car. You see these two displays, these are the biggest ones we have in a BMW and they are really beautifully integrated into the cockpit. They have a reduced and clear design language and what it's best, you can individualize them. So you as a driver are able to decide which content you see on it and which information you want to have whilst driving. For example, here you see um, the newly, a newly arranged information in the infotainment cluster. So. Um, on the left side the speed, on the right side the ref counter and you're able to decide whether you want to see the driving mode or the consumption or you could switch and then you see information about your journey, switch again you see the sport modes information or the connected music information. So this is really helpful. You see in the middle there are parts of the navigation maps. You can decide whether you want to switch it on or off. You just go here to display, go to instrument cluster and decide whether you want to switch it off. Then there is a black field in the middle or you want to switch, switch it on again. What else can you do here? If you are in the middle screen, you can go to your driver profile. We have here the standard profile in it, but if you are a customer, you can connect with your BMW connected drive ID. And then you are able to decide on which picture you want to have for your profile. At the moment we have standard pictures in it, but in the future you will be able to decide on choosing an own picture here. What else is possible? You can go to the speech menu and decide on which language you want to choose. We have chosen UK English now for presentation. All right. And this is one way to interact with the BMW, so by touch. It's really handy, you can move the widgets here and you can, could also decide on whether you want to well do another widget to add another widget or to, to delete a widget it's up to you and um, there's a much more comfortable way to talk to the BMW and it's with the BMW intelligent personal assistant so you just say, hey BMW, who are you? I am your personal assistant. Do you want to find out more about me? Yes. You can address me at any time with the activation word hello BMW once you have activated this function. For example with the command activate hello BMW. Okay, so this is a brief introduction about intelligent personal assistant. And it's also possible to give an own name to the assistant. This is really unique. So, hey BMW, change Hello. your activation word. Please tell me the name of the activation word that you want to use to start the voice input in future. Miami. Super, I've saved my personal activation word. Okay, from now on, we can say Miami to the assistant. So, Miami, I'm cold. Which temperature shall I set? 25 degrees. I set the temperature in the driver's area on 25 degrees Celsius. All right. Miami, please play Jack Johnson. Jack Johnson was selected. 
episodes now that I was able to decide on which music I want to have. And Jack Johnson is playing now. So what else could we do? I could say Miami. I am bored. I can't imagine that. Maybe you haven't yet had the chance to try sport mode. Okay, you see, here are a few chit chats, we call them chit chats included. So like funny little dialogues. There will be more dialogues coming. Um, but mainly this is a car expert. So we can ask um, about the status of the car. Miami, are there any warning messages? No faults detected. Okay, or I could ask, Miami, how is my tire pressure? The current pressure is all right for all tires. Okay, so this is the main domain. It's a real car expert knows about the statues of the car, it knows about the service needs and um, I can control several functions at one time with the assistant. For example, I could tell him that I'm a little bit stressed or I could tell him that I'm tired. So, Miami, I am tired. I have activated the Vitalize program. What happens now is the temperature tops to, drops to 18 degrees. There's a refreshing green light going on. The air is coming out and is pulsating. And there's a vitalizing music with more beats per minute starting. This program runs for three minutes and then it stops automatically. In the case of the presentation, I end the program now. And then all the functions start as they have been before. So now I could either turn the volume like this or I do it with gesture. What I really do like is if I don't want to hear that song, I do like this. So I have the next song or I go back to the last song. Okay, what else is there to be known? Um, if there is someone sitting next to me, then um, this co-driver could say, Hey BMW, I'm cold. Okay, now he listens to me. Which temperature shall I set? <laughs> 26 Wait. degrees. I set the temperature in the driver's area on 26 degrees Celsius. Okay. Well, I don't want <laughs> to listen to Christmas music. And what happens if the person here asks for the same command? Then the assistant knows that the person on the right side asking and then the temperature changes, changes over there or the seat heating changes over there. I ask now for this seat, seat heating. So, hey BMW, turn on seat heating on level 1. I set the seat heating at the driver's seat at level 3. Okay, didn't get me now. Um, Miami. Turn, Hello. turn seat heating on level 2. I set the seat heating at the driver's seat at level 2. Alright. The BMW personal assistant is a system that is getting better and better over time. So the system now needs to get used to my voice and the more I speak and the more I talk to the system the more the system learns and learns to react to my dialect.
for example, I have now a German accent in talking English, the system will get used to that and will become better and better during time. It's even possible to change the language of the system. As I showed you before, you do it here and you decide on which language you want to choose. So this was a brief introduction to the BMW Intelligent Personal Assistant. Um, as you have seen, you are able to address the assistant either by saying hey, hi or hello BMW or as we have chosen the name Miami, we could address the assistant by saying Miami. It's really important for us that the driver or the customer is able to personalize um, the assistant because it makes more fun to talking to the assistant then and we think that customizable assistants are well feeling more natural and so the natural language understanding is easier learnable thank you mm -hmm.